Hey guys, welcome back to another Back to Basics workout. Today we're going to be focusing on chest and triceps. Starting off, the first exercise is going to be a dumbbell chest press. Form is the number one thing to focus on when doing this muscle group specifically because you want to protect the shoulders and you don't want to tear anything. So notice here how I have only a 90 degree angle in my elbows at the lowest part of the movement and then I press straight up. If you have a history of shoulder pain or have had an injury in your shoulders then you want to angle the dumbbell so that your pinkies are lower than your thumbs when you're looking at it from prone position. Next we're going to move into a neutral grip chest press. Neutral grip means that both my palms are facing each other. I'm keeping the dumbbells in midline and I'm pressing straight up, also keeping my elbows tucked. Now you should be feeling this in your triceps and in the anterior deltoid as well. Be sure to keep your feet flat on the ground and press through the movement. Try not to shift your wrists so that you maintain a neutral position in your wrists as well. Next are body weight tricep dips. Here you want to make sure that your elbows are pointing back as your body comes down. You can bend your knees if that helps. Following that we're going to go straight into single arm tricep extensions. This is one of my favorite ones but I also see a lot of people do this exercise incorrectly. So it's very important to have a stable base. You want to row your elbow up and maintain the elbow in the same position as you do the kickback. So the only joint that's moving is my elbow joint. I'm not pulling up with my shoulder. The next exercise is another one that doesn't require a very heavy weight. This is the flat bench dumbbell fly. Here I want to make sure that I maintain the same throughout the entire movement. So I'm not pulling my dumbbells up or down, I'm keeping them in line with my shoulders. Also, to initiate this movement, I press all the way up at full extension and then I slightly bend my elbows and that is the same angle I maintain in my elbows throughout the entire movement. So notice I have a slight bend as I'm bringing the dumbbells to my sides. Another important note is this exercise does not require a heavy, heavy weight. Next is the medicine ball chest toss. Now I like to use a fairly heavy ball. This one I think is 8 or 10 pounds and you want to make sure that you keep the elbows tucked at your sides and you're squeezing the chest as you throw. Now I'm not throwing super high from my body, it's just enough to activate the chest and the triceps together and I really love this movement, it's very effective. Following that we're going to go into the standard push-up. Here maintain a neutral spine and do as many as you can on your toes and then if you have to modify and go onto your knees that's totally fine. Be sure to focus on activating the chest and the mind-muscle connection. Then we go right into the last exercise, which is the overhead tricep extension. I like to use a plate here. I feel that it allows me to maintain my hands in the right track so I'm not shifting with the dumbbells and go ahead and complete all of the sets. And that's it guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you give it a try. If you do, leave me a comment in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.